over here. I can't even take. Oh my God. Oh snap. First days. <laughs> guys welcome back to the swill eats channel all right so we're gonna go ahead and go and hit up kfc they got an oldie but a goodie that just came back out um this week and we're gonna see if this thing is good or not got dave over here behind the wheel playing stuntman over here spinning some tires and all that stuff like that killing me over here man it's like an earthquake but you know we're gonna check this little chicken and waffles deal out and see if this thing is good or not there goes guys it's back chicken and waffles so we're gonna try this out oh and uh, action! Oh, oh, not you come off. I'm going to sleep, take a nap. <laughs> Me too. My, my. Get my yellow bib. No, <laughs> All right, go ahead and open up. What's going on, guys? So back to Swill Eats. We're here with some food for you. What do we got today, Mike? We got that good old KFC chicken and waffles. Now we have some different options. You can get the regular, you can get the, uh, the uh, what's that, hot, whatever it's called. Nashville hot. Nashville hot, or you can actually get chicken with the bone. So, you know, we're in America, we don't eat bones, so that's what we're gonna get. All right, so we get a drink to go along with that. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. Got the most important things are the utensils, this, this uh, knife and the... Look at that steam. It comes in a little nice container right here. It's not bad. It's all closed up, so you know they took care of it, and it's still hot. It's got the little steam going in there right now. I don't know if y'all can see that, but yep. And it's got some Miss Butterworth syrup. Mm. I like Aunt Jemima, but I don't judge. I think they changed it. Is it always Miss Butterworth? I think the last time, right before it stopped, they had something else. I never had it. Ooh. Want one of these hot ones? Yeah, you can me a hot one. Look at this, guys. I think they jumped me. Look at these pieces of chicken. It's like, you got like one good piece. Yours, you got a better piece. Nah, man, look at this. A little dinky one. Uh oh, we got a report on this, guys. Yeah. So you can see. So I guess the KFC, when I went before, they gave me some good sized pieces. So as you can see, I got like one good piece, and then the other pieces are pretty tiny. I got one, I got one dinky one. I don't know what they were thinking. Little dinky ones right over there on the top. But still, it's okay. It's a good size, decent size, whatever. So you can see the waffle. Look at that texture. Nice and crispy. Man, how much does this cost? Here goes the win. Five ninety six ninety five, guys. Six ninety five. That's what you get. This is a snack, not a meal. I don't think you'll get full off of it, but it's you know, it's a good little snack. Under ten bucks. Gotta get it to <laughs> I'll give you a little dinky one, man. This is crazy. Give me that. That's not the dinky one. Hey, you can take the dinky one. I'll take it. Dink, dink, dink. No, I didn't give you the dinky one. The dinky one's right here, man. That's what I could have given you right there. I'm gonna give you that. The ones the dinkies. <laughs> They're like, I'll take that one. I don't want to That's enough. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and open up my good old Miss Butterworth syrup here. Patent pending, Miss Butterworth. I'm trying to think how I'm gonna do this. Oh, I think the way they give the trays, I can post some porter syrup in this part of it. So. A little small, little. So I'm gonna put my chickens in the basket and yeah. then pour my sauce right here. But they only give you one waffle. I thought it could be like a waffle sandwich, you know, but. And you know what? The sauce, the spice is not even on the whole thing, guys. Holy crap. It's only on, it looks like a regular chicken strip. It's like they just they barely dipped it. They just dipped it in there halfway, it. man. What are they thinking? What are they thinking, man? It's not normally the KFC I go to. I usually go to another KFC. It's really good. Um, this one we just closer, so we just went there real quick. It was a brand flash well, yeah. But the one I go to is closer to where I work at, and yeah, it's the much waffle, better. The waffle has like a good mush texture. It's kind of like yeah, it's like a wow, sweet. I guess it's, I don't know. Yeah, you can smell it. It's sweet. All right, so I guess wow. you have to eat it 
I was gonna make a sandwich with it, but I don't see two pieces of waffle in here, so I don't see that. Yeah, you surprising. can get two pieces though. Um, it's a little bit more, and oh, you yeah. can give you two waffles, and then I guess yeah. to give you some more pieces of tender. This so you can't. This is the ghetto. But this is just the, the basic. Get over You pour your syrup in your thing? Yeah. Dip it out. Pour mine in I just want to taste my waffle first and see how it is before I, you know, mix the chicken with it. I'm usually a pancake person. You like waffles? I like both. But waffles will will do it. Let's see how everything is. Mmm. All right, waffles are good. Go ahead, Mark. Describe it. We describe it. Okay, so it's nice. Inside is a little bit flaky, and it's not too moist. It's pretty much dry. I mean, it's like sweetened bread. Like sweetened bread. bread. Yeah, like if you toast your bread and put like it's like a French toast. There you go. Yeah, it's like a French toast. You know, it's almost like. The French toast sticks from Burger King almost. It's yeah. like that. But it's really soft. It's not crispy. Yeah. Not too hard. It's just like good all the way through. When you're holding your hand, I feel like it's going to be crunchier than it really is. Mm. It's not crunchy at all. So I'm going to try these tenders with it now. So now I'm going to try it together. Mmm. Not too spicy. Yeah, it's not really spicy. It's like a tangy. Like it can get spicy, but that's not really the spicy. It's just something else. Oh, bootleg on me. Mmm. Set that ghetto chicken on there. Dip it in the sauce and the cereal. Here we go. Mmm. It's that good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's good. That's what's up. Overwhelming. KFC makes some really good tenders. Um, their sauce that they have too, that finger looking sauce is really good. Never had it. But normally, because I just get it with this, I'm not going to add no sauce. It's just going to be this and this. This is the sauce I got. It's the pancake sauce. I'm not a big KFC fan, to be honest with you. I'm not going to mm. lie. I used to be back in the day. You know, when they had the buckets and stuff. Mm-hmm. But, you know, it's a lot more chicken than waffle. I want some more waffle. We ordered. We didn't know we were ordering anyway. And ladies and she was confused. What right, a sweet biscuit. Not bad. I'm gonna try that. Got a little drink too. The hot one. See, yours looks spicy to mine. The spicy one I gave you. I got one that looks like that, the spicy in here. The rest of them look like the regular chicken strips. Yeah. Well, normally, I, get, I used to get the Nashville. When you get them, they're moist. Like, they dip it in that Nashville sauce and they give it right to you. But. This one like it just dried up on it. It's not spicy at all. So it's a fake out. Mm-hmm. It's like, it's like it's like 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 the Wendy's. Not the Wendy's, the um Popeye chicken you know it's oh spicy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not spicy. Mm -hmm. The sauce is spicy. No, that was spicy a little bit more. Spicy chicken the chicken sandwich Popeyes, a little more spicy than this. Okay, chicken lemon is real spicy chicken. Mm-hmm, man. Wendy's. Wendy's? Mm -hmm. oh, Alright, we gotta do Wendy's again. Yeah, Wendy's got the better chicken sandwich, spicy. Spicy wise, it's true to the spiciest. Well, oh, this is kind of tangy. I can taste bit. it a little bit. It's a little pop, pop, pop. Yeah, okay. Not it's bad. Good. Mm. What's your best side from, from, from KFC? The wedges, mm. potato wedges. That's a little Macaroni. I like the mac and good. cheese too, but yeah, the mac and cheese is pretty good. It's all about those. It's all about that um the wedges. Yeah, big old piece of chicken right here, boy. If I need some spice. I need to try some spice out. I don't know. See, I got flavor to it. It was better. It's better. Mm hmm. Yeah, the spicy one is better than the regular one. So they gave me half and half. Yeah. If I do it again, I'm gonna spicy. Yeah. If I do it again, I get spicier. <laughs> yeah, this is a little more spicy right now. I'm feeling it. I don't like spicy food, but this is okay. It's almost like they got paprika or something put on there or something. I don't know what it is. It's hitting. Mm hmm. The spiciness is hitting. You can feel it just hanging up like boop, boop. One to five stars, what would you give it right now? Like I said, this one, 
this is the best KFC I've been to. I give it like a, a three. Okay, so you're saying that this you you have faith in your, your KFC by your house? Yeah, I can oh, go work out. Yeah, I have to go to buy that one. Hmm. Well, I think we gotta review it as soon as you get it out. As soon as they make it, review. I'm gonna give this a two and a half. It's not that it's bad or anything like that. It's just not consistent. I got spicy. I ordered spicy, but I only got one that has spicy on it. The rest of them look like regular. That's I think how they do their spicy. Well, I think what they do is they get the regular one like this and they just brush it with a brush. And whatever parts don't miss, they just keep moving. It is up. Well, I'm gonna check my bag next time. They need to say, like dip it. They need to go like they need to fully dip it in and put it out. I think they're just like getting a brush and just brushing it. Throw it in the powder, roll it around a little bit. But that's how you done. normally do it. They don't do it that way. They do it their way. They way. Colonel, if you're listening, redo it, man. You kind of went bootleg on me. Two and a half stars. Yeah, you guys got to fully commit to, to like just fully dipping it. Just dip the whole thing in here and then take it out. Have a dipper. Mm-hmm. Well, the waffle makes it better, though. Waffle is really good. That makes it better. If it didn't have a waffle, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, waffle is tough. I'd be like, mm-mm. One star. You get back my money. Two boo boo the fool. 2.5 stars. But I ate this one time, like I said, not by where I work, it was really good. I think I got it right before they stopped doing it again. Hmm. I was like, damn, these are good. A lot of places keep on doing that temporary stuff, man. Like, if you got something on the menu, keep it. If it's working, keep it. I guess they want to see the demand and people asking for it. Like, where this, where to go? Or maybe they have to change some stuff. It's like Popeyes. Like, they do the pull of Popeyes, you know? They're trying to do like the McRib. Put it Bring out it and stop it. Yeah. That's how you got people to come out. It isn't, but because it's a limited time, you think in your head, like, man, that was good. I used to love that Popeye's Super Center. Mm -mm. The make room. What is nice? Look at this flaky. It's like a Danish. Yeah. Let's remind me of a Danish. This is like a breakfast thing. I don't see this for like dinner. It's sweet. This is breakfast. Breakfast is sub, sub, sub. Mm. Not bad. Waffle saved it. So I gotta say. Maybe just like once a month. Now, if you guys got this before, or if you got this last time they had it, let me know in the comments what your experience was with that. Did you guys like it? Hate it? Love it? Smash pass? Whatever you want to call it. Mine's winding down right now. It's winding down. Mm. I mean, it's a decent amount of chicken they give him. Not too bad. I thought three pieces would have been like. It's the waffle, man. It's a waffle. That's enough. Now you just eat straight chicken now. Huh? Chicken and waffles. Some sauce. Roscoe's, what would you say to this? Nah. You it's started Roscoe's over? You started it all. No. You? Mm hmm. But I gotta believe those are the pitch that. That yeah, really was doing it, so they gotta be the, the mm -hmm. originator. It yeah. is. Better go to California and go. That's a hot spot. Everybody goes there. I think Papa's gonna copy them. They're gonna try. They're gonna they, they worried about perfecting no. that chicken sandwich. No, I don't think Papa's gonna do something. I think McDonald's will do something. Oh, God. McDonald's. I would not even do it. Remember Pop McDonald's had chicken before? Mm hmm. Yeah, they got the breakfast menu. And you got the all day, the all day breakfast menu. This would go good on a breakfast menu. Huh. Yeah, with the tenders. Mm hmm. They don't even have to be that big. Like, right. they could be smaller tenders to match the waffle a little bit, you know? There's more waffle. I mean, we're chicken and waffle. It's all good. Yeah, but the spice too in his head. That's too much get spicy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Then you got the rinky dink pieces. <laughs> it's like, there's more crispy skin on the outside than the inside. And it's like, dry now. Mm. Yeah, that's why I say I go to mines. It's, it's on point. I'm done.
I didn't even use my utensils. Wow. You barbarian. I'm just like, um, um, um. Nom, nom, nom. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. We will see you guys next time. Peace. Like and subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell notification, guys. And we'll always keep you guys up to date on the latest trends. Check out our Facebook and our Twitter. The links are in the description below. Thanks for listening.